the next question in this python hacker rank series is set dot discard dot remove so at first they have told us about remove function it basically removes the element from the set and if the element is doesn't uh, present in that set then it raise it will raise a key error whereas in case of discard it will does the same it will do the same it will remove the element and if the element is not present then it will not raise a key error whereas in case of remove it will raise a key error so down they have mentioned it about pop function so this operation will remove and return an arbitrary elements from the set so we'll take a look at sample input so here at sample input they have taken the input of n at first and down they have taken the input of space separated numbers and here uh, down they have taken the input of the number of commands okay so as the input is 10 so they have taken the 10 number of commands so down they have used pop remove and discard function to make changes in this set and at last we have to print the sum of elements of the set okay so as we are performing uh, this many functions on the set so obviously our set will get modified yes first we are removing 9 so 9 will get removed after that uh, 8 will get removed 7 will get removed so our set will change and after that we have to calculate the sum and we have to uh, print that so we'll move ahead to code so here at first they have taken the input of n and also they have taken the input of this space separated numbers and further uh, we have to code for the remaining of things so at first what we'll do we have to take the input uh, of this number of commands so for that we'll take a variable m and inside that we will take the input so i have converted them into integer and now what we'll require we'll require a for loop for iteration and the range we are in this case will be the m that is the number of commands so for i in range so for i in range and uh, we'll pass m as a parameter and down over here what we'll do uh, we'll take the input of this whole uh, sentence so here as you can see they have so here first they have written remove and then they have given us a uh, number so what we'll do is that we'll store this whole thing inside a list so suppose if we access the zeroth element of the list then we'll get only this remove and if we accessed the first element of the list then we'll get 9 okay so it will help us to just identify what all uh, operations we have to do so okay so i'll just code and it will be more clear to you further okay so i'll write first uh, we'll take the input of this remove dot 9 and in the form of list so i'll write list and inside that we'll take input and we are going to split dot okay so it will get splitted when there is when there will be a space so the zeroth element will be removed and the first element of that list will be nine the list name is s1 so now uh, we'll use if and inside that we'll check whether the zeroth element is equal to pop if it's equal to pop then we will pop that element from that list uh, sorry from that set so this is the set and down over here we'll now write the code for discard and remove so for that we'll write else if elif and if the zeroth element of the list s1 is equal to remove so for that we have to remove s dot remove and it will take the parameter so the parameter here in this case for this function will be the number which is this number 9 so the index of this number is 1 so uh, we will be writing s11 one, one. so here in this list s1 
we are accessing the element which is stored at index 1 which is this 9 okay so down we'll write the code for discard elif s the one zeroth element is equal to discard then we'll we are going to discard and we have to pass same s first element as a parameter s1 first element as a parameter and down over here what we have to do uh, we just have to calculate the sum so here I have the here they have told us to do so sum of the elements so for that we'll require a variable we'll declare it over here and down will require a for loop for i in s so as we have performed this many conditions on that set so our set will get uh, will have get modified so from that set will be iterating in that set so inside that for loop sum is equal to sum plus i what it will do it will first take the first element from the set s it will insert that element inside at first it will directly insert it under sum as at first sum will be zero and again uh, for the next element it will add to the existing sum so yes it will just calculate the sum and it will it will give us the output for and at last we just have to print that so for that we'll write print and inside that we'll pass sum okay so we'll run the code and we'll check the output is raising an error so let me check okay so what we have to do over here is that we just have to convert this number which we have taken to integer okay so we'll convert them into integer and now it will work fine so now it will work fine yes it is working and now also we'll check it for rest of the test cases yes it is working for rest of the test cases also the solution for all our other questions including this series are available on my channel and if you have any query let me know it in comment section given below thank you guys for watching this video